Currently in the United States, there are two FDA-approved medications for treatment of obesity or overweight with individuals who have medical comorbidities like high blood pressure, sleep apnea, or abnormal cholesterol levels. The two medications are semaglutide and terzepatide. Semaglutide is also brand named Wagovi when it's used just for the treatment of obesity or overweight with a comorbidity. The exact same medication is brand named as Ozempic when it's used to treat individuals with type 2 diabetes. Terzepatide, the brand name is Zepbound, when it's used again to treat obesity or overweight with comorbidities. The brand name when used to treat individuals with type 2 diabetes is Munjaro. This is pretty confusing for a lot of people because all of these names are not necessarily interchangeable because when your doctor's sending in a prescription, it needs to be for the right diagnosis. However, for individuals who are considering these medications, it is important to realize that they are the exact same molecule depending on if it's semaglutide or terzepatide. There are two GLP-1 medications available for weight loss treatment currently approved by the FDA. There's Wagovi and Zepbound. Wagovi and Zepbound are both approved for individuals with a body mass index greater than 30 or a body mass index greater than 27 with a medical comorbidity. Wagovi also has indications for individuals with those body mass index criteria who are at risk of having a major adverse cardiovascular event, non-fatal heart attack, non-fatal stroke, or peripheral arterial disease. Clinical eligibility for either semaglutide or terzepatide really depends on the FDA indications and if you meet the qualifications. Again, this can be very confusing for individuals because the medications semaglutide and terzepatide have indications for treatment of obesity without diabetes as well as treatment for type 2 diabetes. It's really important to talk to your doctor about your medical comorbidities or medical conditions that you want to treat and your physician will be able to guide you best towards choosing the medication that's right for you.